Woo, that was like a 11 hour marathon last night. Like I said, I told you I have addictive personality. What's up? It's Fist bringing it to you like I do. My Minecraft review. Uh, I mean, this is like a real review. You know, I'm not one of those people who played. I never played Minecraft on the PC. And, you know, I'm giving you this true, honest opinion of a, of a noob. You know what I mean? Somebody who's never played Minecraft. I've never played Minecraft. This is the first time. So I tend to go hard on things. Like, I'll go like 11 hours, 12 hours straight just to see, you know, what's up. And I'll probably do that on Diablo 3, too, as well. So anyways, uh, I played this game um, a lot last night. And what I came to the realization was, is a thing that will will bring you in. See, there's like a reward system. First thing you do is you, when you get this game, it's probably like $20 on a dashboard. And then after you get it, there's a t tutorial. You could go through that. I don't. If you're a person that doesn't read directions, you don't have to. I didn't read the directions. And you could just go through it and learn. And that's the great thing about this game. I know I bashed on it was because it was on the PC, so I really didn't understand. You know, I, I, I'm not gonna buy, buy a game on the PC. Maybe Diablo Three is the only one that I'll get pay for ever, because that was a, because I was a D2 player. Now here's the house that I built uh, last night. Put a little waterfall that goes in front of my. It's kind of like a, it's kind of like an ultra retro. Come here, little piggy, get some. So, it's kind of like an ultra retro house. You know, my first house, like I said, I, I don't like, you know, it's all new to me. But the thing that I think what really gets people in this game is the fact that you can uh, craft things. More or less, I, I think it's more of of crafting than mining. I mean, even though it's called Minecraft, it's more like a crafting game. It, because the, the fun thing is you have to get the materials and then you have to like cook them and then you know or uh, process them to make them better items and then the incentive in the game is that these monsters come out at night like a spiders and zombies and these skeletons with bow and arrows and, uh, and these creeper things that explode and shit so you'll like you'll go after all that stuff and it's really you know that's the incentive like you got to build a house before nighttime comes or if you're like really down deep in the caverns like I got like a huge under my trap door in my house there's like this huge cavern that I go mining for stuff you know so if you want to stay alive you have to like get you either have to like uh, process stuff like milk or make food or plant stuff I haven't got that far yet like planting I just got to building and killing that's like if you're a noob, once you get like further on down the road, you'll probably be building like these, you get like this certain type of ore and like you could build these train tracks that transfer and they got electrical currents and I'm not even close to being that, you know, that uh, creative yet. I'm, I'm like the noobish, noobish noob where I'm just building and killing and, <laughs> and I got cobblestone. I haven't even turned it into stone. So it's like, it's not even refined, you know, the bricks that I'm using. So. I mean, you could take the stone, this cobblestone, and refine it into a finer stone, which, you know, I mean, for my first house, I'll probably build another house in the middle. As I was saying, if you're a noob, you know, it, it it's kind of double, it's like a double-edged sword. You, you build outside of everything, so you're far away from the resources, but yeah, you don't have to worry about all these monsters coming at you at night. You know, that's the trade-off. Here, I build me a little fire. See, it looks nice retro. And when it, it rains, too, it's funny. It'll just rain on, rain on you randomly. I haven't built a roof for that yet, but uh, it's a glass roof. I, have, I haven't finished this house, and I'm going to build a different one. So, overall, I mean, for $20, I think it's a great buy. I had fun playing this game all night, and uh, it's, it's, really, uh, it's really fun to play. So... I suggest you, if you were looking for your best bang for your buck for Xbox Live, this is a great game. So uh, just have fun with it. I hope to see you next. If you like more of these videos, leave them in the comments below. I mean, I got you know I'll do them. It's your boy Fist. Peace. I'm out.